Well, welcome to another video. Today is different though. Today I'm hiking the Raven's Roost Trail. So a few years back, they took down the old Raven's Roost cabin and they have built a new one. And so I haven't seen this new cabin yet. So today we're gonna go find that new cabin and see what it's like. The nice thing about all the trails here in Petersburg that are substantial is they have these like registration books. So you come in here, put down your name, date and time that you started. That way, in case say, like my parents know I'm here, but say that you had a friend or that you lived here by yourself and you said, hey, I'm gonna go hike this trail. Say that you go up, something happens, you got injured and you didn't show up on time. This way, when the rangers and search and rescue come to the trail, they can see, okay, we know for a fact that Ben Higgins made it, at least at this point, so he was heading up. So he must be somewhere between here and the cabin, so let's go and look for him. And so, they're good little safety things that they have, and they're really handy for sure. So, I'll check in and now continue up the trail. Reasons why I love Alaska. Just look at that. You see Frederick Sound over there. You can see the white up here in the snow from the mainland. Just absolutely stunning. Hiked up all those stairs right there. Still have a ways to go. Well, I have just about three quarters of a mile left to go till I get to the cabin, but just popped out of the tree line and I'm in the muskeg and look at that beautiful view. There's still some snow up here. You can see this game trail going through the muskeg up here. So this is just stunning. Now it's been a couple years since I've been up here to Raven's Roost, so they've done a lot of new work on it. Um, the trail's different than what it used to be. Um, but just look at this. This is a new overlook that they've created, and this is the view from the overlook. All those mountains with snow are the mainland. Those three islands out there are called um, Sockeyes. So what I've always referred to them as, and I've heard people refer to them as, some people call them, I think, Sokolov, but, um, Something I was taught when I was growing up is one of those three islands was at one point a fur trading post back when Alaska was still under Russian control. But this is the new overlook spot. Um, if memory serves, the trail used to go up there, but now it's heading back in the woods over there. So just beautiful, beautiful view. Last time I was here, the trail was not gravel like this. It was much more so like a boardwalk when you got up to the muskeg. So those, that's called, that overlook I just sat, Sequoia Islands Overlook, and Raven's Roost Cabin is a half mile that way. And there is the new Raven's Roost Cabin. Here, it's the Forest Service Raven's Roost Cabin, the new one. Beautifully done. Just gorgeous in here. They have a fire extinguisher. They have a, just different stuff right over here. And then they have a deck. Little muskeg lake right here with a nice little bench right there for you to relax at. Just beautiful views. The woodwork is gorgeous. Even have the skylights. But wait, there's more. You also have an upstairs. They have different spots for you to put your jackets. They have a heater in here for people who come in during the winter and how to turn it on. Go up 
this nice little set of stairs and you even have a way up here for more people to sleep. Fire escape ladder for out the window. Even with a fire alarm up there, this is quite a difference between this one and the old Raven's Roost cabin. Come out here, you got propane for that heater. And I think I know what this is, but let's just see if I'm correct in my assumption. But I wouldn't be surprised. This turned out to be. Look at that. It has an outhouse. That's something. The old cabin. Just went outside, pop squat. But yeah, this is the new cabin. Wow. Really gorgeous. I'm very impressed. I just noticed this, but outside the cabin, the place to hang up your jackets. There's a fish. You know, I could stay up here all day just enjoying the views. But unfortunately, I do have stuff I need to do in town, so it's time to get heading back down. But it's just absolutely beautiful up here. I'm really glad that I was able to come up here and that the weather is just gorgeous today. Something I love about hiking is on the way up you get one set of views, and on the way down you get a whole nother set of beautiful views. Well, I just got off the main part of the trail and just signed out of that log book. Now I'm at one of the overlooks and just enjoying this view for a moment or two before I finish the last bit heading down to the truck. Just a beautiful, beautiful day out. Bumped into three hikers coming up as I was going down. Just a gorgeous day out. <laughs> 